Hi, welcome for our RTL online training and placements in Oracle Cloud Technologies. I'm here with another question in Oracle Fusion Financials. What are the set ID objects we have in financials? Set ID means reference data set. Reference data set. In human capital management, we have only four. What are those four? Job, location, department, grade. Only four objects. But when it comes for financials, we have multiple objects. We have multiple reference data set objects. For example, payment terms, customer site, customer account site, like that we have different options. They, they will expect that, can you tell me some of the set ID objects uh, in financials, maybe in account payables or account receivables. Majorly we'll get it from account payables and account receivables, right? So where do we find that list is? We'll go to the task assign business unit, business function. They may ask us like, uh, how will you attach payment term to the business unit, right? Uh, by using reference data set. I'm just selecting our business unit is US1 business unit. And if we look at here, the BU is uh, US1 business unit. It's already assigned for US1 legal entity associated with US primary ledger, right? Now, I want to know what are the different, type, different types of uh, this set ID objects which we have. Go to the task here, manage business unit set assignment, open this task. Manage business unit set assignment. If we look at here, apply hold reasons. This is also assigned through reference data set. So this is a set ID object. And we have other options. Majorly, we can say that uh, customer, customer account site, customer account relationship. This customer account site is very important because in account receivables module, when we are working with the customer, if you create a customer, not a problem, it's a global, which will be assigned for all the business units and we can access from any BU. But when it comes for customer account site, it depends on your uh, reference data set, which we have provided. And uh, this reference data set is associated with our business unit. So we have to remember two more things here, customer account relationship and this customer account site. And then we have dunning letters. Sorry, uh, dunning plans we have, different types of dunning plans we have here. And then we will find uh, the majorly from account payables point of view. Payables payment term, we'll find here, payables payment term. This all comes from the financials point of view. Okay, so customer account site, customer account relationships, payables, payment terms, and we'll also find collection points here and holds, apply holds and releases. Okay, so these all things comes from the financials point of view. Whenever receivables lockbox, receivables collectors, and receivables hazing buckets, receivables accounting rules, and receivables uh, payment term, receivables remit to address, when it comes for payables, payment term, uh, only we will find. We don't find any other from account payables point of view. Majorly we'll find from receivables, remit to address, and transaction source and transaction type, which are very, very important in account receivables, right? So this all comes as a set ID objects in financials. Okay, thank you.